Okay, what's up everybody? You guys are now tuned in to the Chris Heist and Wavy Closet. Closet. Yes, sir. And um, today we have a lot in store for you guys. We're just going to get right into it. My man Wavy got a new pickup. Yes, one of my favorites. Got them for the love of the game sevens. Beautiful shoe. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let's get right to it. Alright, so as a lot of people know, there's a lot of Olympic 7s and all that stuff, but honestly, best quality for the love of the game. Last time these came out before the retro 2010 was 04, and everything, literally everything, is the same quality, besides like a little, this little stitching right here. But even that's not really important, to be honest with you. Who really cares about that? Like, little stitching right there. Everything is the same quality, these sneakers are perfect. Like. Got the leather with the gray, more leather. Then you got like the dopest part is the golden aglets. It's pretty tough. The jump man on it. You know, everything about this is hot. And of course, love of the game heart. Iconic, beautiful. These are probably one of my favorite Olympic sevens. Honestly, I'd rather have these over the 2012s. And that's just that. Like, these shit are really beautiful. What do you think about it, Chris? <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what? These shoes right here, they're just sick. You know, it makes me think of, you know, every hood dude in, you know, in the world wearing rocking knees on 4th of July because you know they pulled it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but um, yeah, this shoe is just sick. You know, Wavy mentioned this emblem on the side. It's on both uh, shoes, actually. And um, what was the name of the Aglets. Aglets, yeah. Usually <laughs> I just call them gold tips, but you yeah, know, these they just. They have a legitimate name. Okay. Nobody knows it, though. Okay. Nobody knows it. I, well, well, good luck on that, though. I, I wasn't even worried. But um, yeah, this is just a sick shoe, man. You can wear these with shorts, you know, jeans, just whatever. It's just sick. So, yeah. So that's that. Yeah. Oh, what could I do in a moment like this? What should I have on sneakers? Our second review coming up right now, we got the playoff ace in my man Wavy Goddess. Let's go. Let's do this. All right. Let's do this. From the jump back, real quick, real quick review because it's not really important that much, in my opinion. They got the retro card, which is pretty dope. Holographic, Jordan doing like, you know, the jump man. Iconic. And he got the Aqua 8s on, which is really my favorite pair of 8s. It's pretty dope. Aqua 8s, pretty dope. But, um, yeah, let's get into the sneaker. Now, these were my favorite pair of sneakers. Don't, don't get me wrong. But I'm not too impressed with the 2013 quality, to be honest with you guys. It creases very easily. Like, your first wear it creases. First wear. Like, it's very, very hard to, like, really keep them looking fresh. You feel me? But at the end of the day, I'd rather these are the 07s. Me, personally, I'd rather have the 07s, but whatever. It is what it is. This is review. So they already got off with the dope colors inside, dope color scheme. I think I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure this is like based off like Will Smith, the way he dressed or whatever. The inside of this. Really? Yeah, I think that's what that's for. It's either that or something else, or Spike Lee something. One of those two. Interesting. Um, they got the stitch in 23 with that with the inside white and the outside red border. Pretty dope. And this is called a mud guard. If you better than know. It's so, like you run in the dirt. Be good. I mean, bottom of the shoe, beautiful. You got the Concord purple, you got the um, infrared red, you have the canary yellow. Beautiful colors, beautiful colors. The whole shoe itself is base black, nice and sleek. It's pretty dope, but the only problem with these I have is the tongues itself. Like the little flaps, they have smooth leather on the inside, but the flaps itself, the quality of the flaps isn't really all that great. I feel like they could have did much better, but it's 2013 with due respect, right? <laughs> they got the embedded Air Jordan logo on there, and they got the pull tag with the Velcro straps. Everybody knows about that. I mean, these will do justice to you if you don't have those sevens or you can't find those sevens looking mint and perfect. These are definitely dope. What you think about them, Chris? Right. Um, you know what? Just to speak on the aesthetics of it, it's just a dope shoe, you know what I mean? 
Um, black and red are my two favorite colorways by far. And just to slip on something so sleek, but yet, you know, you can also wear it athletically if you want to ball up. Because these actually are a great ball up sneaker. Yeah. I've worn these to, you know, play ball in them. They hold up pretty well, in fact. And as far as the bunnies are concerned, I feel like this is just such a classic addition to a shoe. Um, I haven't come across a, a sneaker with these type of straps that I actually care for. Mm -hmm. um, it's just because of how they built, put it on the shoe itself. And it's just like, it's there, but it's not in the way type of thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. It, I mean, sometimes it could get in the way, but um, yeah. most of the time it, it depends on what you wear. But I was about to say, it just depends on how you rock it. And for me, this is just, you know, a sick shoe and a good color. Thanks. Um, well, this is just a shoe. <laughs> well, as you guys know, he does this. Yes. Yeah. This is something that we had, and we've been away for a long time, but trust me, we're not sleeping on here. We're not sleeping at all. You know, I mean, clearly, because check out my man Wendy. He got the uh, Concord on. Wendy, talk about your socks, my man. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, you know, with your socks on. Um, What's these up? are Huff socks or whatever. Basically, okay. they're like a certain brand for, not to so necessarily promote smoking cannabis, but right. honestly, they're cannabis on a sock. It's just sick. <laughs> whether you smoke or not. Yeah, whether you smoke or not. If you're a sneakerhead and you like socks, like, Honestly, I only rock these, the Huff socks, and only rock the Nike Elite brand socks. And that's basically what I do. And these are so beautiful for the, the conference. Like, you just add one to it. Add one, add one to it. Where? Right, and I don't know if you guys are picking up, but my man Wade got the spec song, which is very sick. Yes. Matching his socks and sneakers, you know. I also got the cocaine and caviar. It's called from Crip Life. So cocaine and caviar. It's life I live. This is the drug out there. Not the moment. Not the moment. Not the moment. Okay, so, so check out my feet. Um, we got the Penny the Five, tigers. right? The Memphis Tigers on deck, and it's just you know this shoe is sick. It's very chill, you know. But check out the accents with the stripes. You know? Yeah, that's definitely my favorite part. My favorite part is definitely the stripes. Stripes are definitely real no play. Right. Just you know, just some light for today. Now I got my hair. Polka dot space <laughs> poppers. You know, I got my retro 80s going along with my retro cut. I mean, y'all see it. Come on. Yeah, you're a fly guy. You are a fly guy. <laughs> Come on. Okay, so, my man Wavy, where can they hit you up at? Baby, follow me on Instagram, see pictures of heat and all that at Obey Wavy. That's O B E Y W A V E Y and no spaces. Yes, and you guys can hit me up, Chris Heights Universe. Yes, Chris Heights Universe on Instagram. Ready for this?